Hello everyone, in this video we're going to show you how to manually close the roof on an Audi TT convertible. This is a 8S TT and it's operated by motors on two gear strips. Now these vehicles suffer with uh, failures on the gears. If you look over here, we've replaced them on this vehicle. You can see it has a broken tooth over here. So this roof is now repaired. Now in terms of manually closing the roof, you want to start off by lowering the windows. So I'll just turn the ignition on and lower both the windows. And I'll turn the ignition back off again. The tools you will need are over here. You've got a manual crank handle under the boot carpet and you've got a six millimeter Allen key. So take these out and then close the boot. We're going to start off by unclipping the flaps over here. So if we come around here and look around from this angle, we'll see there's a little ball socket here. Just come lower, you can just see the ball socket there. So I'll get my hand in and pop that off. You can see the flap opens. I just leave that over there. We come around to the other side. Again, same ball socket over here. I'll wait till the camera comes in. I'll pop that off with your fingers. So now we need to open these bolts over here so you can see there's one here this holds the gear strip to the roof frame and there's one on the other side i'll start off by taking this off okay so for the purpose of the video i'm going to use an impact gun just to keep things quick so six mil allen key take this bolt off note this has been off before and uh, there's a bit of loctite on there which we will reef well which we will replenish once we uh, finish this video now if we come around to the other side Same bolt over here. I'll wait till my camera gets in position. Now keep these bolts safe. You do not refit them after you've manually closed the roof. They basically will be fitted after the roof has been repaired. So I'll put them in the cup for now. And now we need to pull the roof out of the vehicle. So I'm going to stand inside the vehicle. And I'll take my shoes off, obviously. Now, this is a two-person job, but if you're stuck, you can do it by yourself. Just make sure to pull the roof nice and parallel. Get it from here. And bring the roof forward. Like this. We'll now work inside the vehicle and uh, open this catch here. Such that it will hook into the windscreen frame. So, you need to take this cover off. You can use a key blade, but I've got a screwdriver handy, so I'm going to use that. Slide that in there and pop the cover off. Okay, so note, the clips come off here, but if you look, the cover pops off and slides towards the rear of the vehicle. Put that to one side. And now we're gonna use the manual crank handle. You're going to open the fork and then close it. The manual crank handle goes in here. Now, don't force this or you'll break it. So it goes anti-clockwise. There we go. As you can see, it's opening the fork over here. going and it stops there. Now you bring the roof down, let it rest on the windscreen frame. Now we're going to turn the crank handle clockwise. As you can see, as you turn it, it rotates that cam in there and it locks the fork, engages the micro switch and locks the roof down. Now, if you feel this is tight, you can help the roof by pressing it down. But if you force it, you'll end up breaking the crank handle. So don't do that. You'll feel that come to a nice stop. And there you have it. You've successfully closed the roof. And there you have it. This is how you manually close the roof on an Audi TT 8S. We hope you found our video useful. And if you did, please hit like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you very much for watching.